NXT. Yeah. And wow. Okay, and st- I'm gonna, I, I'm gonna say NXT was good this week. I, the last match was really good. And also, um, the first one, the first round of that breakout tournament, they were both good. What started off the match was Jao Quinn Wild versus Angel Garza. They both were good, says so someone Garza. He started wrestling in his pants and just ripped them off. Yeah, it's like, ugh, and then just throws it at him. But they both were good. They both freaking, well, they both they showed had, a lot of effort. They both showed moves. The uh, Jack Jao Quinn, he did flips and whatnot. But Angel Garza, he goes to, he goes in the second round. He yeah. he beats him with uh Jalkin with a butterfly stunner. Yeah, butterfly stunner for the win. But that was a good match. I'm looking forward to see more of the tournament. Yeah, more of the new guys. Which there's gonna be another one. I think it's going to be Asia Scott versus Bo, right? Cameron Grimes. Oh, Cameron Grimes. Because um, they showed like a bunch of them up on the screen, yeah. and I think they like you said. I think they're gonna do one a, one every time. Yeah, because I think they want to space it out. To, I guess to give you a little taste. So, but we'll find out how Isaiah and Cameron are next week. Yeah. But the next one ends up being a tag team match: the Street Profits. Yeah. Uh-uh. Versus Forgotten Sons. Oh yeah. See, I like both of them. So this one was kind of a little toughy for me. Yeah, um, at first, at st- first they were talking in the ring, because I guess the Forgotten Sons want a title shot, they, they want the title, because, and then Street Profits were saying, and then they were saying, they were like, well, why don't we just put the titles on the way, I mean, but the only thing about us, you guys won't be forgotten, nope. like they say. You'll just be the first to take the L from the new tag champs. Yeah. And then the match starts. Um. It was really good so far. Yeah, it was good. And then, like, close to the end of the match, um, Angelo yeah. from the Street Profits, he did, like, this, um, he kept going in the one corner, and then the other corner, he did, like, a spinning twist. And then he tagged Montez Ford in, and Montez Ford went on the top corner and did, like, a frog splash. And he's going to go for the pin, and Riker pulls um, Montez Ford out and tacks him. Yeah. And ends up being a DQ, so Street Profits won't ever do a disqualification. And they're all attacking them in the ring. And then you got Oni Lorcan and uh, oh, Danny Birch coming, coming out, saving the Street Profits. And then they end up standing tall with the Street Profits with the Forgotten Sons out of the thing saying, um, what did they say? Oh, we got screwed. Those titles should have been ours. Well, there was a little confusion in the beginning. There wasn't, what was it, like they were going to put the titles online or something? Yeah, yeah, but I think it was just the Street Profits saying they could put it online, but I don't think they actually did. Which would have been, you know, new tag yeah. teams. And then oh. Oni and Danny Burch, they picked up the tag team titles, looked at and then they put it on, they handed it to Street Profits. So, that was that. Yeah. And then, they, then they, there's going to be a, ma- a match next week with um, Perch Pretty Tyler Breeze. Oh my. First, Strogic Strong. Yay. Did I say Strogic Strong? I think you did. Oh, man. Strogic Strong. What the freak was oh, wow. that? Well, it's because you had gayness on the brain there with uh, Tyler Breeze. <laughs> strong is strong. What the <laughs> Well, freak? I don't know. Tyler Breeze is going to get lifted up by him? Yeah. Mm, yep. <laughs> but out of them, I hope Tyler Breeze wins. Yeah. Because I'm not a big fan. I don't like uh, Undisputed at all. Even though we know someone that goes gaga over, yeah, gay gay. Um, and then there was a little outside thing with Arya and Vanessa Bourne. Um, they were just oh. they're pretty much talking about Mia Yim again, saying she's dumb, and might as well just cover her face and keep her hat on, and that 
Um, I guess she has an opportunity again. Uh, Arya has an opportunity against her, and that she's gonna show me him that she's the better woman. She's better than her. And no. And Vanessa's is like, yep. She's gonna learn some books from you. Blah blah blah. Yeah right. No, me and him's gonna kick your butt. Oh yeah. And then next match was I've never seen this person ever. I guess he's from New Jersey. Nico's Rikos. Nico Rikos. And then he went against Keith Lee, the Which I like. What was his thing? He goes I forgot. Um but it was quick it was quick. He he did his um limit breaker for the win. It was quick. He did like he he fucking demolished him. He like boom and then he went boom 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 boom. And then he did the limit breaker. But that was that. And then the main event, Io Sarari. Yeah. For Shayna Baszler. Uh. For the Women's NXT Women's Championship in a steel cage. Oof. This match was really intense and good. Oh my god, yes. Yeah, I A lot of cheating involved, too. Yeah. Io tried her best. She tried, but ooh, a big shocking at the end with Io. Um, yeah. But... She tried everything. She tried doing moves. She tried getting anything. She tried escaping over the cage. She tried going out the door. She tried pinning her. She got put to sleep a couple of times, almost. Yeah. Um. She did. She um. She did a German suplex on the top cage. Right on the yeah. top cage. Cause, cause let's say. Io was on trying to escape, and then Shayna grabbed her, got her out, and Shayna started to climb, and then Io quickly get back up there and did a German suplex from the, on, the, on the top. Yeah, because the two, her two, uh... Yeah, and then the two henchwomen yeah. came out, of course, got to try to help, and because Io, she's on the, trying to escape, and then the ones climbing up. The, the brown head one? The brown head one. Yeah. And Cameron. I think, what's yeah. her name? Right. Candace. Candace. Not right, Cameron. Right. And she's coming. And she's climbing up. She whew, her away. And then um she, <coughs> she, and then the one as um going to get Shayna, the blonde head one. I'm trying to wake her up. And then Cam Candace Ray She's on the top thing, and she goes, whew, boom, right on to um, the blonde head one. And I'm sorry, I think it's Jessamine Duke. I, I think I don't really know their names. I think it's Jessamine because well, we don't like them. So, <laughs> um, but and then she's that was a long, that was a tough fall. So you know, um, and you think an EO is gonna escape? Cause she has a chance to just hop out of the thing. No, she stands on the top of the cage and does a big vlog splash looking thing. Goes whew, right on Shayna. Yeah. So she's trying to escape the door, and she Shayna stops her, goes back to the door, stops her again. Um, and then this time she goes out the door. She's getting close, but yeah. Shayna gets her in a slipper hold. Oh man, we thought she was out. Yeah, she she looked like <clears throat> she was gonna pass, but then all of a sudden we see her grab the door and she's banging Shayna's head to get her to let go. But yeah, she let go, all right, let go out of the door, so she retains the championship. Yeah, after a few, I was like, oh man, I thought she was gonna like if she was gonna get hit in the head with it, I thought she was gonna go backwards, not forward. And then, um, after the match. Candace is standing there with Eo, saying, it's okay, it's okay. And then all of a sudden, Eo snapped. She's heel. She's tacking Candace LeRae. Yep. And then she gets a chair, goes back in the ring, and tacks her with the chair. And then she sits the chair up and does, like, a move on the chair to Candace LeRae and leaves. And then goes, um... I don't need friends. And then she starts speaking Japanese. Yeah. I don't like, need friends and blah 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 blah. But she's definitely a heel turn. And a lot of people see that's another thing. A lot of people are like, 
Woohoo! Heo! Woohoo! Heo! And then also she turns heel. Boo! I don't like you anymore. I don't care. She can be heel all she wants. I still like her. I like wrestlers for their talent, not if they're heel or bad. Like, for example, um, I like the Shield, right? And when Rollins turned himself against them, I still liked Rollins. When Dean was turned heel, yeah. I still liked him. Miz, still liked him. Punk, still liked him. I don't turn on you. Yeah, that's just not me. If you got, if you're, if you show you're good in the ring, then I don't like you. Yeah. So, but yeah, that was pretty much NXT. Yeah, that was an interesting NXT. It was pretty yeah. good. I, I thought it was good. I mean, yeah, because NXT, you know, they show everything. What did you thought of that steel cage match? Did you thought it was, um. Interesting. Interesting. Did you like like the, the cheating? Yeah, some people like that. Well, but um, did you like how uh, Eo turned heel and went against Candice? Probably gonna be a match. Eo versus Candice array. We know that. Um, yeah. did you? How did you like the first round of the breakout tournament yeah. with Angel and Jacqueline? Who do you, who, who did you like out of them? Um, mm. about the Forgotten Sons of Street Profits, who would you like about them? Yeah, like I said, I, it's hard for me because I like both. Um, do you think Mia Yim's gonna lose to Arya? Or Vanessa gonna cheat and help Arya? What do you think about that? Um, excited to see Tyler Breeze for freaking Magic Strong? Oh boy, Gainus versus Strong. Um, who do you like out of the other breakout thing? Isaiah Scott or Cameron Grimes? I don't know. I have to see. So, yeah, we have to see them wrestle. So, but that pretty much was NXT, really. It was good. Let us know yeah. what you thought of NXT. What did you like? And we'd like to know. Yeah. So, um, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.